Omaha at Effley Airfield at 37 miles per hour. So that just shows you how windy it was throughout the majority of today. And we're still not really done. After sundown, which was a while ago, we did see it decrease a little bit, but obviously still breezy out there. Sarah just mentioned there at, uh, that's the Omaha Riverfront. 42 degrees out right now. So keep in mind, if you stepped outside right now, that's what it's going to feel like during peak heating tomorrow, only windier. And our wind's out of the north-northwest at around 13 miles per hour right now with a wind chill in the mid-30s. Here's our temperatures, mid-40s for a lot of us. Some of us already into the upper 30s. If you're not into the 30s right now, you're going to be well on your way as we get further into tonight. We're going to maintain a northwest breeze. It's going to be lighter as we go through the overnight hours, but still there. That's obviously a colder air direction. And let's talk a little bit about the patterns that we're seeing moving through here, because that has a lot to do with why we're not seeing rain and why it's so windy outside. So we had that cold front come through earlier. A lot of north winds coming behind that. That strong north wind is going to continue. Notice this high pressure system comes in. It's going to turn almost more westerly wind to us on Monday, help us warm up for Tuesday. But then this cold front comes through. And notice how the cold front's oriented very east uh, to west. And you, when you want more moisture into the area, you really want more southerly winds ahead of that cold front. And if it's oriented more north to south, that's more common. But it's not that case. And behind it is going to be a lot of northerly winds. So it's just going to be windy outside. We're not going to get any rain from any of these fronts that are moving through. So here's your lows. Uh, to start tomorrow. It's going to be about 30 degrees outside below the freezing mark just about everywhere. So the wind's going to pick up throughout the day. It's going to feel chilly outside. Look at the chill we're going to have to the air. 22 degrees is what it's going to feel like as you step outside tomorrow at 30 degrees. We'll not really warm up much. Gets about 43 degrees. Northwest breeze will be around 15 to 30 miles per hour. We could see gusts a bit higher than that. So definitely take that into consideration as you head out tomorrow. Only a high of about 43 degrees, so you're definitely going to want maybe the jacket, you know, if you're more susceptible to the cold. Maybe you want the heavier coat stepping outside tomorrow. And we don't get much better when it comes to Monday. Bump those temperatures up about 3 degrees. We're going to be at 46 here in Omaha. The wind's going to be out of the west, like I mentioned before. A little bit lighter, but still not a great difference. You're still going to have a noticeable breeze. And then spring starts on Tuesday, and we're going to start on a good note. 61 degrees for the high. But after that cold front comes through on Tuesday, I think it's going to drop those temperatures down the following day. We're still going to have sunshine because, like I said, there's not a lot of moisture in the air for that cold front to work with. So it's just going to be breezy from that. We won't get any rain from it. But look towards the tail end of the week. We do have a few chances of some moisture getting in here. And if we don't see it Friday or Saturday, I think maybe Sunday, Monday, the following week, we, we might get some moisture. So it's just going to be a dry and mild stretch, Sarah. So wash that car now if you're going to do it. Oh, good time to do it. All right. Thank you so much, Luke. Well, coming up in sports.